Now on Alpha 1, not Gen 2, earlier, just regular Alpha 1, the distinguishing features, again, it does not have the raised uh, portion up here with the lifting ring, I guess you'd call it, in the cap. Um, it does not have ribs over here or fins, whatever you want to call them, running back. That's definitely the older series prior to Alpha 1. And as a comparison, I'll show you on the other one. If I put my fist here, it's pretty much even with my fist. It's about four inches, whereas the Alpha 1 Gen 2 is about six inches. And then the other feature, where the trim cylinder mounts, it mounts to the very end of the drive. It does not mount back here like it does on the Gen 2. And also, how the upper and lower cases bolt up, you don't have those exposed bolts showing in this area over here. The mounting bolts are here and they're underneath uh, and that's what holds the two halves of the case together of the outdrive together the upper and lower with no bolts over here and uh, that's pretty much it for a um, for an alpha one also part number I'm not sure if that's a serial number or the drive number uh, but it's located in this area over here usually there's a sticker that goes over it so you can't see it but if you peel the sticker off that's where it's located On an Alpha 2 drive, the distinguishing features are, one you'll notice it doesn't have the rib up here with the hole through it, which is on the pre-Alpha drives. Uh, it also doesn't have the ribs over here, which are on the pre-Alpha drives. Uh, it has an oil level cap here and one over here. Uh, the distance between here and the end is wider than my fist. Now on the other drive, it's about even with my fist. So it's a bigger area here. Down here, where the uh, trim cylinders mount, it mounts from the this far from the end. On uh, an Alpha 1 Gen 1, it would mount here. But now on the Gen 2s, it mounts inboard uh, a little bit. Also, the mounting for the upper and the lower, the bolts go through. They're through bolted instead of on the uh, on the Alpha One Gen One. The bolts go through the bottom, and uh, they're they're hidden. The other feature is over here. You have this for the oil. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. You have this extra hole over here for the oil to fill the uh, the housing, which then runs through the transom assembly and then runs up into the uh, on the back of, inside the boat uh, to an oil reservoir to keep this thing topped off. Also, you'll notice the number is located right here. It's in the same location as you find on the uh, the Alpha One uh, series drive. Again, bigger space here. Mounting uh, for the cylinder here. And these bolts go through from top to bottom. That's Alpha 1 Gen 2.